Welcome to this senior edition of Channel 97 News. We come to you from our homes. Although the 2020 school year came to an abrupt end, we are here with our final show to commemorate our senior class. Let's start off with hearing some of our broadcast seniors' favorite memories. So my favorite memory from broadcast was working on the Hannah Yates story, and then I actually got to go downtown to Channel 5 and got to watch the show happen live and see all the behind the scenes and stuff. So that was really awesome. My favorite broadcast memory was when we got to take a picture and meet Pat Maroon. My favorite memory from broadcast was when me, Ryan, and Matt got to film our spring break story. We spent a lot of time together and had so much fun exploring St. Louis together. My favorite broadcast memory was when Lauren, Jenna, Hunter, and I drove all the way to Webster University, got lost in a church just to find out that they wouldn't let us interview them. Okay, so my favorite memory from broadcast would be being able to line produce my senior year and then getting to ask Pat Maroon the questions when we interviewed him. The best part of broadcast is being able to do with my friends while also making new friends. Something I learned from broadcast was how to think outside of the box and take risks because even though sometimes it didn't turn out the way we wanted it to, we still learned something from it. Broadcast has definitely taught me to be more creative. From broadcast, I was able to learn about deadlines and organization and then obviously about technology and editing. But mostly from being a line producer, I was able to learn about leadership. The thing I learned in broadcast that I didn't learn in any other class is, again, the independence, which is something you don't get in every other class. And it's just a breath of fresh air to be able to have that kind of control and be able to and being able to take that kind of responsibility and do it yourself. The best feeling in the world is whenever you get done with a story and then all the stories get put together to make the big show and you just get to see all of your hard work pay off. It's absolutely amazing. OHS is full of hardworking students. Some have even earned academic scholarships. Let's check it out. The following students have been awarded at least 50% of their college tuition through scholarships. Allison Navarra, Haley Goh, Chase Otto, Georgia Hamburg, Amanda Green, Andrew Carter, Emma Eisenhofer, Kaylee Calton, Lauren Long, Christopher Gibbons, Emma Tate, Sean McGinnis, Abby Jacoby, Jenna Frisella, Marissa Montandon, Abigail Abishan, Hallie Azell, Dylan Mollett, Caitlin Jackson, Tommy Jackson, Savannah Rhodes, Allison Turner, Zachary Wells, Hannah Phelps, Alec Coffrin, Sam Gindler, Savannah Ma, Zane Caudell, Hannah Bradley, James Drennan, Demi Elroyd, Alex Pruitt, John Yeniv, Logan Wyas, Jordan Borowski, Shaylin Fraunhofer, Jay Krakiola, Allison Stanford, Courtney Dorr, Lily Singer, Maddie Bruton, Adam Leaker, and Emma Sullivan. Oakville is proud to congratulate our academic scholars. However, those aren't the only students going on to do great things. Let's meet our college-bound student athletes. Took my chances. When the distance 
Wish the best of luck to our student athletes. There are many changes that come with going away to school, one being food. But have no fear, the cooking segment is here. Let's take a look at some seniors' favorite recipes. After 12 years of hard work and dedication towards our diploma, we got signs! <laughs> All jokes aside, on the behalf of the senior class, I would like to thank parents and staff for their love and support. Here's a behind the scenes on what had to happen to make this sweet idea a reality. We are doing We Love Our Senior Signs today on Saturday as a surprise to the senior class. 2020's had a rough go at it so far and uh, the principals kind of came up with the idea to do some yard signs we've seen on social media, lots of places doing it, and we wanted to get on board with that. So uh, Laura Bishop and I kind of did the legwork and got some signs ordered, and the, she pulled in Becky Bruning, and the, between the three of us, we Google Doc this thing to death to get it organized, and tons of teachers and some parents have volunteered to drive around on this beautiful Saturday. Uh, putting yard signs in all of our seniors' yards just as a surprise. We can't see our seniors and we love our seniors so much as we love all of our students at OHS and so we're just doing what we can, bring a little cheer. We know where some of our students are going next year. Here's a look at a few others from the class of 2020. <laughs>
I would like to thank Millville School District for the past 12 years of my educational experience. The following clip is a small portion of the graduation video dedicated to the class of 2020. Well, that wraps up today's show. Thank you so much for joining us. Stay gold. And remember, Oakville, keep your eyes on the tigers.